I would like to, before we talk about your books, work and the uh, mentoring work that you're doing, I, I, I would like to go back to the what you were talking about your future self and you were talking about the, the need to being focused on being more value creation in the future, in the present. Yes. And I asked you to go back and look at what you've done. So, you know, for five minutes, let's, let's, let's talk a little bit about what we just talked about and how it reflects to what you believe needs to happen in the future. Mm, what a great question. Um, the, what I think needs to happen in the future for each one of us is to understand that we have a, uh, we have a present self and a future self that, uh -huh. that, that, that is um, just like, every corporation has a present value and a future value. Mm -hmm. And um, what I used to do in, in evaluating companies to make a decision, whether it was a buy or a sell in any particular moment, that's a decision. It was to evaluate the difference between your present, the present value of that corporation in that time and its inherent future value. And if that inherent future value looked like pretty promising, it was a buy, all right? I think we can do the same analogy as individuals now. So the present value of my circumstances, my life, and all that, my, that, all that I've ever done, ever been, uh, all of the accumulation of knowledge and experience, which has great value, right? You would agree. 